True crime, devil's sake. Well, YouTube, dangling here. Uh, someone had given me a name. Someone had also asked me in a comment if I've been looking into the um, Facebook. Um, Delphi murder case. <clears throat> Unfortunately, right now I'm not on Facebook due to a uh, aggravation of Facebook. <laughs> uh, yeah, I um, I just don't go on Facebook much lately because I uh, put myself up there for. You know, <clears throat> posting my stuff, hoping to get noticed or whatnot. And I don't know. I do have a Facebook page, but like I say, I do not go on it. <clears throat> and um, I don't know. Facebook lately has been nothing but a uh, headache to me. You know, it just ain't. It just ain't worth. Looking in the stuff because of a simple fact, right? Every time I go on Facebook, it's all nonsense. You know, I want to look into compelling stuff. You know, not about someone's problems. Or, you know, someone else's disagreements. Or this person said this or this person said that. That he said, she said bullshit. I'm not up for all that stuff, and, you know, a lot of times that's what Facebook is about. I mean, I've been trying to catch a break and, you know, put my evidence up of ghost hunting. Or put up my, you know, videos of my thoughts, theories, and ideas, but, but, unfortunately... Hang on a sec. I should have Unfortunately, it just ain't enough for me to, you know, want to be on Facebook. <clears throat> I did write. I mean, the only last two things that I've wrote or written on Facebook was letting all my family and friends that my uh, father and mother passed. Other than that, I haven't been on it to do research or anything, but... I did look up the name of the person someone had mentioned, and I got this. I'm wondering if someone's talking about this cop. No, Ted. But other than that, as you can see, what has come up is just, you know, cops talking, state troopers. And I mean, if someone is saying this police officer, I mean, just by looking at the hairline, which I think it goes in the opposite direction of Bridge Guy, but, eh, if I had to do an analyst on that, maybe, but, you know, I still haven't found the picture of the other guy I was looking for either. I mean, this is what happens when I go look up stuff. Images, articles. And the most recent article of the four-year anniversary is just the same old, you know, BS. And they're calling it not a cold case. But yet they have no suspects still. <laughs> but anyways, you know, and then this guy came up. Which is no relations, I believe, to the, um, what the hell is the name? Hornin, or Hornan, or whatever the name was. Other than that, this is what I got. Oh, there it is. Horman, Dennis Harmon. Jesus Christ, it'd help if I read the name that I've written. <laughs> That's what I got for images and um, 
you know, faces. And I don't know if that other cop that I just had up, if he's supposed to be, but his name ain't Dennis, I believe. So I don't know. If anybody's got images, instead of me just looking in, why don't you just send them? Because, I mean, I don't go on Facebook right now because it's just a pain in the ass to me. <clears throat> like I said, I was, I was up there trying to, you know, get looked at and noticed. But, unfortunately, and I have to spend more time on this page than going on that page. Because I just ain't got time for both of them. That's a bigger issue there, too. I don't have time for both. <clears throat> but anyways, as you can see here, these two girls, sisters... I'm going to be doing a um, video on them, too. And these two just popped up. And I don't know why they popped up under this name. Or maybe it was just a sign. <laughs> Go figure, because this case here is still cold. And, um, brutal shotgun murders. But I got another, I got a video coming up for them girls. Sad stories. But I'll be also throwing in uh, life learned lessons, which young girls should um, really abide by, because these two girls are really young, Jeez. and I can even understand them why they got shot, and it was due to, you know, being too young too young but anyways the Dennis case Dennis Harmon I don't know as you can see this is all that I got like I say if this is a cop yo here yeah, come here come here that I'm supposed to be looking at which his face did come up Along, well, not clearly, but alongside Bridge Guy, but I don't know. Whatever this may be. <clears throat> if anybody has a picture of this guy, or if they're um, correct on who I found, let me know, because as I can see, I mean, this guy is way too old. If they, uh... I was saying this guy and his son are involved, but I don't know. Someone needs to throw up some pictures in the comment box if they could. <clears throat> Anyways, I don't know. Someone said in the, in the comment, though, I didn't get to read till today. Have you looked this up or have you read this? And, Someone else is commenting and, <clears throat> you know, whatever. I just, like I say, I don't go on Facebook. I ain't got time. <clears throat> Especially all the nonsense on it, but. Hey, at least I'm trying to keep things going here. Because, like I say, <laughs> to me, everything that's been done is pretty much can, is all that can be done. You can point the finger of whoever you want. You can keep saying it's this guy, that guy, and him. But when there's freaking DNA evidence and none of these people have been matched up yet, you know, there's nothing more to talk about. Get the goddamn bastard in there. Take the evidence. And match it up. <clears throat> but it seems to me, right? The DNA just don't even matter no more. Everybody's just trying to point the finger. And don't get me wrong, man. This, this guy has a kind of resemblance. But I think he's too old. If that is the guy, but <clears throat> like I say, 
this stuff right. And, and even in the new article, 2021, they claim police haven't given out no more new evidence or information. Right, they're keeping it, you know, tucked away. Because to me, the good crew, the good crew, not the meth crew, but the good crew, somebody there has something to hide. And they don't want to leak that out. Because it's a good guy. That's what I think. I guess you can say a lot of good guys ain't good. <laughs> Look at Chucky. <laughs> He was a good guy. Calling you him his buddy. You gotta remember, folks. There's always a dark, evil twist. And when there's something on the table, rather than an image or a picture, then law enforcement needs to get their head out of their ass and start taking blood samples, DNA testing, enough of this bullshit, he did it, he did it, you can't point the finger until you get the proof, and don't get me wrong, I'm not trying to bomb anybody out of who they think the killer is. But when the friggin' law enforcement in the beginning of this case, way back four years ago, tell you there's DNA, and then nothing comes out of it, then okay then. <laughs> Something's wrong there. Why are they holding back? It's sick. And they won't release, right, the severity of the girl's murder. It's sick. Everything is sick. And it's sick and tired of just getting the same old BS. <clears throat> Think about it. Everybody's gonna everybody's gonna have their own thought and theories. Everybody's got their own description of the killer. They all think they know the killer. But I would let it rest on the DNA. And right now, that's right. That's being covered up. Naughty, naughty, naughty. Very naughty to do that. Like the uh, guy on Frosty the Snowman. Naughty, naughty, naughty. That's right. <laughs> Something's got to give, man. Four effing years. DNA exists. No. Buddy. Convicted. And oh, man, I can feel the family's frustration right now. Right now, four years later, that's right. If I was in their shoes... It would not be a day that would go by that a fist of mine wouldn't fly through a wall till I hit that beam, <clears throat> break a knuckle, and sit there and say, God damn it! Why? Where? When? How? Fucking man. <laughs> Isn't this world great? I'm not one to get into politics. I try not to do that too much, but... Yeah, they tried to impeach Trump. And what are they saying? The justice system is broke. Hey, he incited a riot. But yet, they're not going to prosecute him. Right? And it is left to wonder for all these murder victims. 
<laughs> Just think about it. How broke the justice system is. Only the boy down there, South Carolina. That I'm going to make an honor video to him. And hell yes, my fucking fellow Americans. Hell yeah. The boy did a deed. Vigilante justice. And I give that kid a hand standing up on the back of my neck. I'm speaking of this, but a 12-year-old boy. I want to give him a proper video, boy. Proper salute. I'd love to go down there myself personally and shake this kid's hand. That's right. And that will be in one of my next videos. Because what this kid did is a goddamn honor to have a person with a set of cojones the biggest as big as any mafia boss in this goddamn forsaken world. That's right. But I'm gonna honor that kid in one of my own videos. And that's what I'm talking about. The justice system's broke. People break laws, break rules, get away with murder, this and that. And what does it lead us to? Two dead girls here and no justice. Think about it, folks. Just think about it. All you can do is sit there and shake your head a million times. Excuse me. Put that fist through the wall. And just sit back, take a deep breath. And hope the next day will be better than today with a capture. Or a conviction. Or that person himself that committed the crime, dead. That's all I got to say until that next video. Be safe. Take care. Always beware. Remember, justice isn't for all. <laughs> justice for all, huh? <laughs> Man! Show me justice for all, and I'll show you hundred thousand dollars, a hundred grand. I'll show you a hundred grand. That's right. Out.